டிவிவி என்டர்டைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் மற்றும் லைகா ப்ரொடக்ஷன்ஸ் இணைந்து வழங்கும் எஸ் எஸ் ராஜமௌலி இயக்கத்தில் ட்ரிபிள் ஆர் மார்ச் இருபத்தி ஐந்து முதல் திரையரங்குகளில் பாக்யலட்சுமி திங்கள் முதல் சனிக்கிழமை வரை இரவு எட்டு முப்பதுக்கு உங்கள் விஜய் I really love a woman's beauty which is considered abnormal mm. in society. I mean I did not stop I keep doing that every once in a while in fact I have an affinity to be attracted to more dark side of the human mind like, uh, like Surya's versatility is an unbelievable what he does yeah Showing sex scenes is considered as a taboo. Normalize it and I say whenever you make a lesbian film you always want to see the... Uh, you would like to see a powerful man and a woman to look beautiful and sexy. But Mani and me we just collaborated on, on Thira Thira. Yeah. But uh, he didn't like any of my ideas. I think like in your visa idea So if I don't care about the people I don't need to make the film Hi hello this is Karthik Govind Raj I'm very pleasure to sit near a great director Ram Gopal Verma sir hello hi, sir hi hi actually uh, from Tamil Nadu like fans of Tamil Nadu uh, the name Ram Gopal Verma RGV uh, remains like raw uh, and your movies like Sakya and Rakta Charitra have you ever st- stopped doing movies like uh, um, gangster movies I mean I did not stop I keep doing them every once in a while in fact I just finished a film called Konda which uh, okay. Yeah, it's using sometime soon. Yeah. Uh since beginning, your movies were not much very colorful yeah. or a happy face. You have a perfect shade. So uh, Yeah, no, I basically am I mean uh, inclined to I have an affinity to be uh, attracted to more dark side of the human mind like horror, crime and uh, violence. So I think uh, those kind of films usually don't have color. I don't yeah. I don't like to make happy films. I don't like to make films uh, which the whole family can sit and watch you directed big stars like amitabh nagarjuna and surya sir i mean i think it's difficult to measure i mean they okay. they see when especially with someone as big as amitabh bachchan over, over the decades i, I mean with where, where the superstar is there where the actor is there and where the human being is there i mm. think all those lines get blurred in my mm. mind you know and uh, so, and they both all have equally i mean a very uh, different kind of approaches for example mm. uh, like surya's versatility is un- unbelievable mm. what he does yeah and coming back to the dangerous movie and it's like a lesbian and thriller movie and in india uh, even showing sex scenes is it's considered as a taboo how come you uh, deliver such kind of uh, lesbian movies with yeah. a thriller genre yeah. no i i basically one reason i did uh, dangerous is to normalize it and mm. i say whenever you make a lesbian film you always want to see the i mean the negative side and mm. people might say this people might say that and uh, all that but uh, the moment you make a film where you're treating them just like uh, they are normal people mm. i think that makes a strong statement yeah okay uh, rgv's heroines are very glamorous and uh, and after uh, acting in rgv's movie and every heroine become very famous uh, how do you choose the heroines and have you ever noticed that uh, they are getting famous once they are cast in rgv's movie yeah i mean i, I think is because i i really love a woman's beauty and i uh, i uh, very passionately capture them mm. either in a song or in their character or anything but i'll always look for people who can i mean i can't make anyone look good eventually the, there has to be something there in the person mm. you can just enhance it you can't create mm. yeah like capturing a heroines or glamorous heroines uh, we need a story for that like in this dangerous we have a lesbian story on other other stories so yeah. how come you uh, start a story on or like you have a vision of telling a story yeah i mean it will always start with the fundamental idea of mm. what the what uh, what is this film is going to deal with you know so for example in dangerous context i wanted to say, i wanted to make a film which will just normalize something which is considered abnormal mm. in society so what kind of a story can fit in that will be the next mm. which is the story idea mm. once i decide on that then it becomes a screenplay even this uh, lesbian kind of story 
can be made as a beautiful love story do you think a thriller genre is necessary for portraying this kind of stories i mean no i see you can make uh, to make the same point any kind of a story but i thought i will set it in a very men kind of film this kind of film if it's made with a man and a woman it will be like uh, any other film mm. but uh, what they used to see mm. in a format to put two women i thought will be uh, create that uh, very mainstream experience and i personally noticed like uh, your heroes or or the men you portray was very very powerful characters yeah. how you visualize a men and women in your stories as a hero and heroine see i always believe in a very natural course of things a man uh, you would like to see a powerful man and a woman to look beautiful and sexy mm-hmm. you know i think there is order of nature in the context uh, for a role model you look at them you look at a beautiful woman as a role and a powerful man as a as a role model mm. you know i think i follow the same pattern and uh, many of the people like criticize rgv like uh, he is doing uh, glamorous movies just for the sake of money so what's yeah. your play for them see the point is uh, whether you need money to make the movie or you need make a movie to need the money is a like the tree first or the seed first question mm. any filmmaker eventually the bottom line is he'll want as many people to see mm. and money will come only if people see Mm. so you can't say making it for money mm. okay so if i don't care about the people i don't need to make the film only yeah okay and uh, you made many mainstream movies and you, you have gone from tollywood to hollywood you've gone bigger and bigger and now uh, i think uh, have you think you isolated from the mainstream cinemas i was never a part of the mainstream i always made films which are very genre breaking and uh, okay. like for example after my first film shiva mm. i made a horror film called rath mm. you know then i made a caper film called shanakshanam mm. then i did a, a satya which is a gangster then i did kaun the whole film shot shoots mm. in one small house you know so i think I always kept on changing and i never followed a pattern at all and you have worked with uh, many legends like uh, uh, manikatnam sir and anurag so can you please share some memories regarding ha <laughs> see man like mani and me we just collaborated on on tirada tirada yeah but uh, he didn't like any of my ideas and uh, <laughs> i didn't like any of his ideas okay. so he made his film and i made my film yeah uh, like coming back to an indigenous movies and you have made like uh, many ott movies and many short stories and uh, being a legendary director you have made many movies for the theaters how can you uh, shrink yourself to a short film or for an ott movie so how come your first i mean see things? that's a question of my view i mean okay. eventually it is uh, eventually whether it's a short film or a one minute or one shot hmm. eventually it is a creation of mine and it will work for whatever its uh, intention or purposes mm. yeah and last question what is your current opinion on your on our prime minister and governance you know i'm i'm actually honestly i don't uh, care about uh, politics i don't follow it also and coming back to again dangerous movie in tamil nadu and uh, there are uh, not many movies like which shows like lesbians or lesbian sex even as yeah. a lesbian love story so how do you think like uh, tamil people will take this i mean i don't think it's about tamil people or telugu people or hindi people eventually people are people at the end of the day and uh, the subject does not have any bearing in uh, tradition or it is set in one particular region or or anything so i don't think uh, that will make a difference super sir thank you for your yeah. time